So this is a continuation of my previous video. As you can see, I'm still keeping the cornrows I did, but I'm going to change the style this time around. So here, I'm just going to put the lower section in a low bun together with the cornrows. I'm not keeping it separate, I'm packing everything together. Then after that, I'll go ahead and divide the bun into two. Then, I want to form a kind of, uh, should I call it a puff or a bun? So I'll just stretch it, then I'll just braid or twist the tip, just the tip. So I'll not push the braided or the twisted part inside and it will form this round puff. Then I'll repeat the same thing on the left of our hair, the other side. And you should get something like this. Now it's time to style the front. So I'll just twist it the way I'm doing it in this video, not the other actual twist. You can still do it that way if you wish. So I'll just twist it the way I just did here. Then I'll pin it down on top of the lower section and notice that i'm pinning it to one side i'm not doing left or right like i did in the previous video so this one is just to one section i'm pinning them to one side because i want the head to have this um soup i don't even know i want it to just I want the style to just be on one side like that, you know. Mm. So that's why I'm doing it like this. I'm dropping it to one side like that. So just be taking the hair in sections and I'll be pinning them to one side under each other. So, just trying to see which one looks better. Then, I decided finally to pin it this way. And that is just it too. The hairstyle is very simple and easy, very quick. Even if you are in a hurry, you can actually achieve this. And then you go ahead to use pins just to make sure the hair is secure. And that is it. This is the final look. And I love what I'm seeing here. The hair is very beautiful. So guys, let me know what you think about the hairstyle in the comment section. And also remember to give me a thumbs up.